everyone, it's Nikki DX Girly. Welcome back to another uh, video on my DX Girly Likes Toys channel, my second channel that's all about toys. Talking about them in my toy room. Today is another doll review Wednesday and surprise, it's another pull up. Um, so today I'm going to be reviewing Pull Up Merle. Merle came out in July of 2012, if I'm not mistaken. Um, I bought her from pullupstyle.com. As of when I'm filming this, she's not in stock, but you're not going to see this for a while, so I would check pullupstyle.com to see if she's in stock if you are looking to get her. But yeah, that's where I got her from. And she was at a decent price. Not they pull up style always has decent prices on pull ups, in my opinion. Um, sometimes you can get them cheaper other places, but they have really fast shipping. And um, from what I've heard, I haven't held, had to have dealt with their customer service yet, but really fast shipping. And I've heard that dealing with their customer service is top notch. So, uh, yeah, check out the pull ups on there if you're interested in them. But here's Merle. She is like in sailor nautical type style. Um, up here it says Whispering Island model. <laughs> Not really sure what that means, but that's okay. Um, sorry for the their the front of their boxes are super reflective, and I'm sitting in front of blinds here. That's why you're seeing all that. Um, but yeah, there she is. Here's her box definitely goes with the nautical theme very cute yeah let's open her up okay so here she is out of her box um, I didn't take her hair stuff off yet because that's extremely satisfying <laughs> and I'm sure some of you like watching that on camera too so here we go love that part I don't know why that's so satisfying to me but it is oh got your it's very tangly right there I don't know why oh it feels like not nice well I'm gonna have to get a wig brush of some sort and try to manage that. I don't know why it's like that. Mm, that makes me sad. It's all like crunchy. Okay, well, ignoring that. If anyone has any tips on how to get rid of that without chopping off her hair, how to make that nice and smooth again, Please let me know in the comments down below. Um, but she does have really lovely hair, other than that. <laughs> um, it's super soft and nice and long. Very pretty. It is a little bit flat. Uh, like, there's not much volume to it on the top. You can kind of see her wig cap a little bit right through here, where the bangs and the normal hair meet. But, uh, it's still pretty nice. Um, so for her outfit, she's wearing this really cute little choker with a key on it right there. Super adorable. It's like made out of like a velvety material. And it's got like little circular designs on it there, if you can see that. Um... And then she's wearing this really cute little sailor dress um, that has an adorable little sash on it, I think. Yep, the sash um, just has like a snap button closure, so that can come right off. Where did... Hold on, guys. Sorry about that. I just realized I dropped her hair bow. And I didn't know where it went. Um, her 
front little dress here can be removed. It has like real buttons here, right here. And they're pretty easy to undo. Hopefully it'll be easy to get back on. I say it was easy and now I'm struggling. <laughs> because that's how, that's how video making works. Okay, so it just comes off like this. And then it has this really cute, simple white dress underneath with this really nice lace at the bottom. And it doesn't have um, like all of the layers that a lot of the other dresses do, but she is wearing these really cute little bloomers underneath. She's so cute. So that just buttons up there. And then it has these, this ribbon on the side. It only has it on that side, it's not on this side. And then it just looks like that in the back. Super cute. Um, and she's wearing, now, if you saw my very first pull-up review, I was like in love with the shoes. Well, she has even nicer <laughs> shoes because they're not like plastic like I'm used to in fashion dolls. They're like these leathery type materials. I don't know if it's real leather or not. I couldn't tell you. I'm gonna say probably no. Um, but they're actually laced up and they're really cute and then she's wearing these green and brown striped socks under them <laughs> so cute okay so she comes with two hair bows the first one's this really big one and it comes with like a barrette on it let me put it on her and I'll show you So this one, um, it kind of helps mask that little problem area in her hair, kind of, not really, but <laughs> it's really big on her. It has like little bows on the bow, so it kind of looks like that. She looks better in the stock photos with it on, but um, let me try. She also comes with a smaller bow. If I can get this one off. With a little tiny barrette attached to it. There we go. So there she is wearing the little bow. I'm sure I could get it on there better if I <laughs> finagled with it a bit, but that also has a little tiny bow on it too. It's probably, I think it's backwards, but whatever. Um, so I'm really happy with her. Oh, let me show you her face up. So her eyebrows just kind of look like that. She has really, really, really pretty eyes. Um, kind of smoky around the edges for her face up and nice long lower lashes you can see that there um, gorgeous dark blue eyes um, and again if you don't haven't seen a pull-up review before and you don't know about pull-ups they have mechanisms in the back of their head the lever in the middle um, can I can get a good grip on it here turn their eyes from side to side and then pressing the little buttons on the side she actually can close her eyes she has just like a flesh tone with black eyeliner and they do have actual rooted eyelashes too come on there we go um so yeah, that is Pull Up Merle. I'm a little sad about this. I don't I'm gonna have to try to look how to fix this because her hair is so pretty otherwise and this just, I don't know even know how it happened. But she is very, very pretty and I am happy with her otherwise. 
she's super cute so let me know what you think of Pullet Merle in the comments down below. If you collect pull-ups, do you have her in your collection? Let me know. She also kind of has a line right here. Kind of, it looks like, like, you know when you put your hair up in a ponytail and it's been up there for a while and then you pull it out and it has that. I think that's just from the little pieces of plastic that were on it, but yeah there is pull up Merle. So um, if you're not already subscribed to my channel please check out my other videos. I do doll reviews every Wednesday. Um, I'm trying to do Disney pins every Sunday. I did miss a couple of weeks there but I'm um, trying to do those and I do at least one blind box opening uh, with like four at a time but blind box opening a week and then some other random toy videos thrown in too so if you're interested in any of that please subscribe to my channel I would love to have you here with me I really um, value and appreciate every one of you that takes the time to subscribe and even just watch the videos um, it really really means a lot to me <laughs> so yeah give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it thank you so so much for watching and I will talk to you next time bye Hey guys, so sorry for this little update at the uh, end of the video after I've already finished the video, but I just wanted to pop on and say that I was able to get that really crunchy, frizzy, kind of fried feeling uh, patch out of Merle's hair. If you see it right there, it's a little actually straighter. If you remember, I said it had that wave in it from... Um, it looks just from the plastic because it looks like she had a ponytail up but this little section right here I was able to um, I poured like boiling hot water over it so it straightened it out very nicely and it's super smooth now so I just wanted to give that update to her about her because uh, I know that kind of put a damper on the rest of the review but I am super happy with her um, I also wanted to show you she did come, I forgot to tell you in the review, she did come with a white stand, and here is her card. Super cute. So yeah, she's really cute. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to pop in and say that, so <laughs> I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!